soon, you're going to see a new tool popping up in hospitals, making the operating room a whole lot safer for doctors. And tonight, my personal story with a Cincinnati icon, a man who found out firsthand the dangers of a very common thing that surgeons use and why technology now has their backs. And suddenly I had a pain in my back and I couldn't use my arms and my right leg started giving away, which has been, quote, the good leg and I just had to lay on the floor. The Dean of Cardiologists, temporarily paralyzed. After more than 45 years of working his magic inside the cath lab, legendary Cincinnati heart surgeon, Dr. Dean Kiriakis, had his livelihood stripped away. I started to posture, which is um, being a quadriplegic, where you're, you have no control over this. Your arms are flexed up, your wrists flexed down, your hands are like this. Dr. Kiriakis, the man with a legendary reputation in the biz, the doctor who people come to see from across America, forced to the sidelines and forced into surgery, this time as a patient. I actually was in the hospital for a month, um, couldn't walk, couldn't move my right leg or my right hand. About six months ago, after battling back problems and other nagging health issues, his body broke down. He needed a reboot. It just worked hard with um, physical therapy, but literally, by the grace of God, I got these functions back. Dr. Kiriakis blames it on the heavy 35 or 40 pound aprons people in the OR wear to protect themselves from harmful radiation. Over time, that literally crushes your spine. If you're an interventional cardiologist for 20 years, your chance of having a significant spine injury is about 60%. Walking without a cane, all of the feeling back in his hands and legs, now Dr. Dean is making a comeback thanks to new technology. This system uh, has side panels that come all the way down. It has uh, positionable panels and it has a panel, this is not quite put together yet, from the ceiling. It blocks the radiation right at the source a game changer in the medical world. And now with the lead-free radiation protection system, which is going to take the country by storm, trust me on this, um, I'm going to be able to go and do the procedures that I love to do. Dr. Kiriakis says Christ Hospital will soon be the first in the area to roll it out, fitting 12 cath labs with brand new protection. People in the operating room will no longer have to wear those heavy aprons and caps. It's better radiation protection, and we can do procedures in our scrubs. You can literally show up in your scrubs and do the same procedures. It's giving him a second chance to share his incredible talent. A Cincinnati jewel can keep sparkling. So the protection in the Christ Hospital cath lab that will be provided by a company called Egg Medical. It's allowing Dr. Kiriakis to get back into surgeries pretty soon without being concerned about carrying all that extra weight with that leaded apron. Yeah, he's such a just uh, coveted doctor in this area and around the world. So great for him. But, you know, as I'm watching this, I'm thinking there are a lot of people in the operating room. You have nurses and anesthesiologists. So I'd imagine it's helpful to all of them. And it doesn't do it justice just looking at the apron. When you pick it up, you could do curls yeah. with the thing. Yeah. It is really heavy. And as he gave you that stat, a lot of doctors across the United States suffer back problems because of it. Glad.